Super bitchy! Ah, 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 ah. I don't know what that was, but I'm not mad at it. I just want to keep the lobby open and see who we can get in as everyone is filtering inward into the upper echelons of viewer numbers that we so rightfully deserve. Just um, poke him if you got her. Oh, I just noticed they put Christmas tree. Oh, oh no. It's that weird French ass Christmas short. Oh no. I need to watch that again. Also, no, I did not lose weight in the picture. My doctor was nice enough to mention how much I needed to get my weight down. Well, you look fine in that picture, though. Your face looks very slim and trim. Very wayfish, very elfish, very young alabaster skin to be sliced open for your virgin nutrients. For hot Hungarian duchesses. Or Baroness, or whatever the fuck she was. Which also, that wasn't true. Apparently, she, uh... Punk pick Hey, punk, 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 punk! What's up, bubbly? But apparently, Elizabeth Bathory didn't actually do it for, um... Youth, or, uh, whatever there. She only did it, uh, because she was just a dyed in the wool psychopath. And sadist. And had, uh, money and servants to enable her. The vampire, virgin blood, stay young forever myth was added to try to rationalize how could someone do that because the phrase serial killer hadn't yet been invented. Alright, hey Siri! Hey Siri! Set me a timer for 95 seconds! One minute and 35 seconds, oh. counting down. Might not be necessary, but that's how much time you have to get that last slice of pizza. Yeah, her motives were more boring than reported because people, again, tried to rationalize how could a woman of power and prestige, how could a woman of upbringing be so cold and cruel? It's because she was a vampire, not a human, silly. She was a monster. Real aristocrats don't do that. Oh, bitch, I'm always teaching the children's. Shake my head, now we're gonna learn that it was all period blood. <laughs> well. <clears throat> I can't say shit about that, but I can say shit about uh, how gladiators would sell their sweat to horny women. And then they would rub it into uh, lotions to rub on themselves. And ring Hades' doorbell. <coughs> I mean, technically all blood is period blood eventually. It gets down there at some point. Only in AFAB bodies. Well, no. I haven't tried that experiment yet. Not the 90s yet. Alright. Last lights of Pizzi still up for grabs. I thought this uh, rogue uh, olive here was a... Uh, was a button I could have pressed, but all right, here we go. Start the cock. Spread those pheromones. <laughs> Get that from the tap. In each round of writer riff mode, a movie clip will play. Every clip has a spot to write your own joke or riff, as we call it. If you're stuck, you can choose a randomly assigned riff from one of our own professional, professional comedy, comedy professionals. At a slight point deduction. Everyone's riffs are played back, and you vote for your favorite. At the end of all the rounds, the player with the most points wins. That was really bad trigger discipline on the man from Harlem. Sorry, the guy from Harlem. Round all right. One. <clears throat> Time to get serious. Here is a good little boy. His daddy is quite rich. Here is a good little boy. His daddy is quite rich. <laughs> oh, I see we're starting strong tonight, Riff Tracks, aren't we? A Riff Tracks holiday special. Bless you. Mm-hmm. <laughs> 
I expect great things from all of you fuckers. Also, don't forget, you can tell us which one you want us to see. What one you- Oh, hold on, hold on. I think we're playing for number six here, baby. Number six is a special kind of hell that I think we all want to go to. I mean, I can fuck the butt of that chin. Here is a good little boy. <laughs> Daddy is quite rich. He would never be seen again after their New Year's trip to Fire Island. Jesus God, already. Here is a good little boy. Daddy is quite rich. I am ham slamming his daddy in the broom closet. Here is a good That whip plays us. Jesus Daddy God. Is quite rich. So good or not, the whole family's going up against the wall. Here is a good little boy. Daddy is quite rich. He's bribed all these other children to be his friend. Here is a good little That's boy. That's cheating. <laughs> daddy is quite rich. No, Daddy, don't make me play with the banana again. Oh, my God. Here is a good little boy. Daddy is quite rich. Good. His father, however, is a minimum wage worker. Mm. Jesus wept. Oh my god. Shake hands with strangers. Alright, see, so we all understood the assignment, I see. And don't forget, chat, you too can vote. Just type a number in the uh, chat of who you think should win, and they'll get some bonus points. There's a new person on the couch. Monica. That was a good one, super. God damn, that was fucking dark. Okay, Rip Tracks, are you choosing now to say I'm as I am? <laughs> oh. This is the first recorded event of a reverse donkey oh show. Oh my, okay. Fine young specimen. do. Live footage of the Midwest Fur Fest protests. Fine young specimen. do. <laughs> Look on the bright side. You donkeys get to meet Caligula. Fine young specimen. <laughs> Oh, you didn't hear Aura? Just need him to fight some lions at the Coliseum. <laughs> a bunch of Trump supporters protested outside of Midwest Fur Fest last weekend. It's time for Daddy to get relaxed. Oh. Fine young specimen. Hail do. And I'll be having a slamming time tonight. Time oh. to place your vote, fellow rippers. Down down. Yeah. Uh, there's a, it's a very famous, uh, well, it's a very infamous photo of a guy in a Trump jacket with a sign that says, this is what a dying society looks like. And, uh, pointing out a first suitor, but the first suitor was cropped out. The first suitor actually is, uh, making them go viral by saying, I'm so proud to have stood next to this picture to cause this sign to come out. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I think this was the same one that got, uh, chlorine gla gas attacked a few years ago, too. Because it's a big furcon in Chicago. And Chicago, yes, has some of the best gun laws in the in the nation, but it's next door to a state that has the worst. Well, would yeah. you check out the riffing Punk Piglet slamming the ham tonight. Time for Daddy to get relaxed. Cheers, May. I'll drink to that. See, I love Reverse Donkey Show. And Caligula. I, I, you know, you can never go wrong with Caligula. Except for, you know, if you're Rome. Round three. 
Mm. So this is what Santa Claus is looking at through his fantastic telescope. So this is what Santa Claus is looking at through his fantastic telescope. Santa Claus is fucking boring. Okay. <laughs> don't. <laughs> don't give me my. Don't give them my answer. Fuck, <laughs> my was gonna be a reference to Mr. Hands. <laughs> Hold up. Hold up. That number six looks like the same animation quality of the fucking, um, you know, the Italian cartoon Titanic with the rapping dog. Oh yes. You know, there's something you should know, so I'm gonna tell you. So don't sweat it. I think that's the other, other one. The, the other, other Titanic. <laughs> <laughs> it's not Titanic. So Titanic. Okay, that remix sounds like a, a song that we sung on RuPaul's Drag Race for like one of the challenges. <laughs> You're right. Number five, I think, is Discount Peanuts, actually. <laughs> I think that really... I can't believe we're not sued. <laughs> <laughs> I can't believe it's not butter. My dude, most things are not butter. <laughs> Look at that Timmy Nook was the one saying that. Yeah. So this is what Santa Claus is looking at through his fantastic telescope. Santa was appalled that the grubby mitts of meth addiction had <laughs> Fucking God. The, community. the price for elf whores has gone down though. <laughs> so this is what Santa Claus is his fantastic telescope. It's shit. <laughs> so this is what Santa Claus is looking at through his fantastic telescope. And later tonight he'll be looking in all the little boys' windows. Uh there it is. So this is what Santa Claus is looking at through his fantastic telescope. That's what his lawyer claims anyway. <laughs> so this is what Santa Claus is looking at through his fantastic telescope. A sad, dingy, cut-rate theme park. Merry Christmas, everyone! So this is what Santa Claus is looking at through his fantastic telescope. Cause those magic mushrooms are kicking tonight. Okay, we all had a good laugh. Now time to vote. Just like Hootie Tang. Oh, it was for the that one bowl. Oh, okay, yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Simper five, motherfucker. The price for elf whores has gone down. Oh my god, the economy! Elf whores in this economy? Oh. Yeah, that's a good one, Super. Well, look at you! I bet you had a good breakfast. Mm -hmm. She sounds so Wisconsin-y. Who's Monica? I know. <laughs> Damn, fuck me. Okay. Pui Tang is when you Hi. use pussy juice to make Tang the powdered drink. <laughs> oh no! Oh god! Time to bring the funny. Enter your riff now. Hey, I got a question. Oh no. Have we seen number one? We have not. <laughs> There's a lot of new. Tr I don't know. Six is also a fresh hellscape. Oh yeah. We we haven't seen any of those of these clips. These are all new. I think three we've seen. That's a talking cat. Hmm. But I haven't seen that boy. You have seen that boy. He's the only boy. He's the boy in the talking cat. No, the, but that, that boy's brown haired. Oh, hold on. This boy's blonde haired. Oh, I am at an angle. No, you're right. That just looks a lot like the staircase from <laughs> the talking yeah. cat. Which is, which is <laughs> strange because it's a bed. That's not a bed. The, the one with the fucking mosquito netting on it? That's that is a stair. Staircase? That's a staircase. Okay. What the fuck? <laughs> That's a staircase? Maybe we can share this hallucination. 
<laughs> My, do they know their staircase is the jellyfish? <laughs> oh. Oh yes, excellent sacrifices this time. You and your husband may live another year. <laughs> I expect nothing less, Aura. We'd love you to meet our new Rottweiler. <laughs> oh no, Santa's a loner. Is that like a gooner? No. <laughs> mm. Listen, you legally have to tell me if Boar is going to be involved. <laughs> <laughs> I've already came. <laughs> oh, yes. More snuff cub videos have gone down drastically in quality. You got a favorite riff? Vote now. Can't believe I'm voting for this one. You don't have to. No, I'm gone now. No, no, it's done. <laughs> Shake hands with dicks. Lunars are balloons. Now that I know, knowing is shaft the battle. Now the question is, Miss Miguel Conti, which one is mine? I'm going to go with the snuff cup video quality. I'm guessing I've already been. Yeah. One of those is Monica, one of those is you. Yep, called it. Well, look at this hot Don't shot. ever question me! I should get extra points for that, thank you. No, he gets them for being voted on. <laughs> oh. Oh my god. <laughs> mm. Speaking of war. You've seen the clip? Now oh. enter your room. <laughs> I want the snuff Santa of number two. Why does number five look like Santa is a Bond villain? Because number three is from Santa Claus Conquers the Martians. Which apparently uh, is what Kevin Bacon is watching in Guardians of the Galaxy hol holiday special. Oh shit. We have to watch it. We both have. Yeah, we do. I haven't watched any holiday shit yet. Me either. Only thing I watched was a Thanksgiving movie, Planes, Trains, and Automobiles. Those were the 19 F-bombs in one scene. A young Jack Nicholson doesn't know whether to be terrified or aroused. Deep down, he likes it like that. <laughs> As a man from the 50s... As Harvey Korman. <laughs> was incredibly confusing for Steve. <laughs> Jack Nicholson's gonna fuck Here the I turkey. Here I distinctly told you not to use the breadcrumbs you put in my ass last night for the stuff for today's turkey. Who fucking fists with breadcrumbs? I don't know why I looked at you for that. The fuck is this shit, Martha? <laughs> God, I had a vision of myself in a horrible holiday special. <laughs> uh, um... Am I Harvey Corman or just some guy who looks like him? I'll never know. The riffs are in. <laughs> Time to vote. Trend alert, Harvey Corman. This is needed after the November holiday, right? Mm -hmm. Well, it's just... I don't know what to say other than it's Christmas, and we're all in misery right now. Mm. 
Because you're all in the straight family. Yeah. <laughs> Why are there no turkey fucking videos for that? There are, you're just not looking hard enough. Mm -hmm. I'll stick to pumpkins, thank you. I mean, I don't... You said what you said. No, everyone knows I'm a grapefruit fucker. The fuck is this shit, Martha? <laughs> well played, Monica. <laughs> well played, Monica. Yeah, oh my god, Monica. Round six. And now Christmas. That and now, the Christmas. Mm. Hey, there's more than one way to fuck a turkey, Aura. <laughs> Drumstick action. Just petrify the giblets. It's easier when it's frozen. Don't forget to baste yourself. <laughs> I didn't sign up for this. <laughs> for all the holiday specials I wanted for Christmas Eve to go to YouTube because I'm too lazy to record anything else, this is not the one. Oh, Jack Frost! The one that actually fucks people to death in showers. Oh. I don't think they have that scene on this game. That would be rated AO. Or M. No, 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 Bush. It's tasteful. You never know. I don't know. Looks like he's molesting Betsy Palmer. AKA Mrs. Voorhees, if you're nasty. Okay, number six tells me that Vor absolutely happened in that clip. <laughs> and now a young mouse link is about to. Stealing my dad's boots and hat. <laughs> the bodies of the children were soon eviscerated. Frosty is still on his ramp. <coughs> <coughs> yep. See, eating the yellow snow is great for you. Just look at him go. Of course, clockwork. That can be fixed. <laughs> <laughs> Frosty looks a little cracky this year. Cracky? I don't remember Jimmy Durante looking like that. Here we go again. Time to vote. The snowman or... Mm. <laughs> I think it might have been Shannon Elizabeth. Oh, look at those fluffy faces. Fluffy, puffy faces. Yes, that's the movie. Yo, not, yeah, not the one with fucking uh, Michael Keaton. The heartwarming family romp of a dad that dies too close to Christmas and comes back as a snowman. Bra ta ta ta! Oh, I'm just so proud of you. Just like Pootie Tang. But goddamn, Monica ain't got shit on me, or I ain't got. Wait, I ain't got shit on Monica. Michael Cleveland. Round seven. Barbara Streisand. Marla, Marla, don't touch that. What's the problem, Sam? <laughs> it's just a scar. <laughs> Marla, Marla, don't touch that. What's the problem, Sam? <laughs> it's just a scar. <laughs> Are you the next top riffer? 
enter your rift. Fuck! Oh, I forgot to add something to mine. God damn it! Oh well. I love the gunshot noise and <laughs> put through a silencer. <laughs> I love Wednesday's dance. Marla, Marla, don't touch that. What's the problem, Sam? <laughs> it's just a scarf. <laughs> That's not a scarf, lady. <laughs> Marla, Marla, don't touch that. What's the problem, Sam? <laughs> it's just a scarf. <laughs> Scar, someone order the David Carradine special? No, lady, that's a Gucci cashmere and silk blend. Now I'm gonna eat you. just a scar. Damn it, Marla. Now the snowman thinks you flag flag. Marla, <laughs> don't touch that. What's the problem, Sam? It's just a scar. Oh, fuck, it's my axe. <laughs> Marla, don't touch that. What's the problem, Sam? It's just a scar. Oh god, I felt his cold carrot against my special lady hole. <gasps> Got your favorite? Vote now! Special lady hole. <laughs> special lady hole. With the wind whistling through your gully. And the wild, wild world of Batwoman. Welcome to the stage, special lady hall. Oh god, what is this? <laughs> yeah. Yeah, that's a good one. Simply stunning work. And thank you, Punk Piglet, for the one person to actually get my joke. If you don't know, David Carradine killed himself with autoerotic asphyxia. That doesn't mean that nobody got your joke. Oh. Round eight. <laughs> Santa Claus, you love me, don't you? Say you love me, Santa. You went out like a boss. You were lucky fucking dead. If you go out while nutting, then you fucking won at life. Santa Claus, you love me, don't you? Say you love me, Santa. It's go time, Mama Jama. Into your ribs now. Robin Williams had a movie about a kid dying from that. I know. And people say that maybe he actually didn't kill himself, that it might have been, uh, a guy I went on a blind date with said that, and it re lives rent free in my head. Oh. oh, oh, Sly, just, 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 just put the number, don't put anything else. No vote, no nothing, just put two, enter. You did a Mormon Epstein? Yeah. Uh -oh. mm. I don't remember, uh, you, you know what? I would say open a different tab. What's number six? Holy fuck balls. Number four is also pretty terrifying. And so well, number three looks erotic. Number three looks like a Russian fur suit video. Now you don't have to vote for six. I'm just saying six looks wild. So you can vote for four as well. I mean, don't, don't block the vote. Vote for what you want, baby. I can perform any other way. Just ask the insider Blake. Go, 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 move, move, move. Moon, moon, moon. Santa 
I'm a verse top, yeah. You love me, don't you? Say you love me, Sancho. Bobby, I've told you, this is just a casual thing for me. Uh, I'm gonna say friend alert. Santa Claus, you love me, don't you? Say you love me, Santa. But when I do this, I'm escorted out of the mall. <laughs> Santa Claus, you love me, don't you? Say you love me, Santa. Small child, I know Chris Hansen sent you to entrap me, ho ho ho. <laughs> this isn't my first rodeo. Ever. Santa Claus, you love me, don't you? Say you love me, Santa. Ho ho ho, what a fucking simp. <laughs> Santa Claus, you love me, don't you? Say you love me, Santa. Sure, little boy. Now bend over and drop your drawer. Oh, that's a little too Buck or no Pico Santa for me. Claus, you love me, don't you? Say you love me, Santa. I L L show you have much I love you. Timmy, where's the butter dish? My God, you could no. All right, I'm gonna blind vote for one, so I don't know which one will make me look more like a pedophile. Oh God damn it! Uh, of course, I voted for the worst one. I know, Lenoir. <laughs> Don't we all? Don't we all, baby? Didn't he also, like, go down for, like, pot a child thing, Chris Hansen? No. No? Okay. That would've been too cinematic. Oh, fuck. Okay, thank you, Super, I guess. Clementia, that was a goddamn great one. Now everyone gets to expose their sins. It's fine, Aura. It happens to all of us. Yeah, sometimes you get an itch. Oh. Look at all these. He thinks he's Santa Claus. Santa's summer home. Look at all these. He thinks he's Santa Claus. Okay. Take a deep breath. <gasps> Santa Claus conquers the Martians is number two. Yeah, that's the movie with the jellyfish stairs. Number three has Santa in the cucking chair. Hmm? You know what I mean by the cucking chair. <laughs> we've all sat, we've all had a turn in the cucking chair. It's hot, and don't deny it. You know, you got Cheerios, honey bunches of cucks here. Look at all these. He oh. thinks he's Santa Claus. Um, Dad, why is there a picture of Santa and Mom? <clears throat> Look at all these. He thinks he's Santa Claus. And you think Mom loves you, but you don't see me making a big deal about it. My him. Christ! Look at all these. He thinks he's Santa Claus. Wow, Dad, that's all you have to say. Mom is very obviously cucking. Trend alert, cucking. Her dressing up as Santa. Look at all these. He thinks he's Santa Claus. He hung his doll E2 art on the wall. <laughs> look at all these. That's a modern riff they just Santa made. Claus. Yeah. And look at that Halloween picture. He thinks he's Freddy Krueger. <laughs> look at all these. He I can get behind the gingham Santa one. Claus. Why is mommy with him? Trend alert! Mom's cheating with S Mo I saw mommy hey, fucking Santa Claus. You've had a good laugh. Now time to vote. You've had a good ass now. Rift Rock is just exposing us all, Aura. 
<laughs> I saw Daddy fucking Santa Claus, but it really wasn't Santa, just some guy that Mom had paid that night to come down our chimney flight. I saw Mommy kissing Yog Sothoth. Mm -hmm. And she survived? I doubt it. Show me potato salad! Super. Well played, but fuck you. <laughs> I saw Peggy. I have, I, I have heard Cthulhu Carol's sorcerer. Damn, Clamanatha. Ham Slammer. Okay, Rippers. It's the final round. All this trouble over a fat little man in a red suit. All this trouble over a fat little man in a red suit. It's that time again. Enter your riff now. Pretty fucking cool. Right? <laughs> All this trouble Tragedy about her forehead, though. Yeah. Mm. <laughs> Martians have 70s relief pitcher mustaches. <laughs> Shit. <laughs> All this trouble over a fat little man in a red suit. And a big brown man in a green suit. Oh. All this trouble He's not over really brown. a little man in a red suit. Hey, leave Jim out of this. You know his new red suit is the only thing he had to look forward to after the divorce. Oh my god. All this trouble over a fat little man. I'm glad we're therapy for you, Vixen, but you should also get real is therapy. Is he fat or is he little? Mm. All this trouble over a fat little man oh in a red suit. Anyway, enough about Alex Jones' <laughs> meltdown about non-binary Santas. Over to sports with Bob. Bob, how many pink pongs <laughs> have you stuck god. in the All this trouble over a little man in a red suit. Reporting live from Mars as bitch baby general cries and over chubby chaser wife complains about getting cut by Santa. Film at 11. Time to place your vote, <laughs> Which one's my bottom? That's my bottom. That, no, here's my bottom. There we go. Oh, the way you look at me says like I saw something that means that makes me need to scream, but we're alive, so I'm gonna scream in my jacket. No, every sneeze comes with a free cuber stare. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Do you know where your bottom is? Bitch, yes. Check out the high score on this one, people. I don't think it was. Well, maybe enough. Mm, no, <laughs> not enough. Clamantha got too many. Bitch baby crying. General bitch baby. And the winner is... Clamantha. Well played and well deserved. Well clamped. Well clamped. I feel moist and cold now. <laughs> Just like a New England summer. Clammy. Oh, uh, yeah, it was nowhere near. <laughs> 5,000 points spread between me and the clam. Mm -hmm. Jack, bro! Durr. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> we would never be allowed on AGDQ. <laughs> <laughs> Within seconds, we'd be I cursing. I would the mic and they'd kick me off. <laughs> <laughs> The calf would be on fire. <laughs> Remember, kids? What's uh, up, you little bitches? Get out. <laughs> cleanliness goblin, safety woman, meat raffle winner, and Duffy the cat. Jack Broder would be popular today. Thanks, bros. <laughs> Remember, kids, let your clam stew in your mom's post for 24 hours before making the clam chatter. <laughs> right. All right, well, 
Clockwork Sorcerer wants in. Well, we, we need a new room. Ripping. Let's let Clockwork in first, y'all. Vegetable. Veg yeah, the, the, it's a... The password is, in fact, Christopher Reeves. <laughs> Sorry. That was... <laughs> Half the audience didn't get that, but Lose or I did, or I did. Oh my god! <laughs> Listen, okay, okay, okay. So hear me out. There is that was low. Well, he's buried six feet deep. It's fine. I'm not even gonna go that low. He's been dead for over ten years. What the first Rocky Horror Show live show I went to? That scene where like where Brad's like getting mad at Frankenfurter and eventually just strips his glasses off. The audience goes, "It's a bird! It's a plane!" And then. It's Superman! And then the MC in the audience goes, That's not Superman, he can walk. And then when the audience boos, he goes, Christopher Reeves has been dead for 15 years. It's time to get over it. What's up, Ala? Squadala? Clockwork, are you in? I think I know you don't like being <coughs> asked, but. <coughs> you are? Okay, have at it, bitches! <coughs> Get your grubby, greasy paws all over this vegetable. <laughs> There's no security on this hospital floor! <laughs> ah, it's a thinking man's joke of Pussow. Your knowledge of riffs shall be great. <laughs> What's a palette? I need to rewatch Willow before I watch the new show. The new show looks fucking beautiful. Oh, Mr. Hands is here. The horse, the horse, the horse. Now, don't don't be talking too much to me about horses, because I just watched Nope. Hello, and horses are a big part of Nope. If each round and I have yet to mode, see a movie Nope. Clip will play. Every clip but you should see Nope. Right yeah. And you should see Nope. If you're stuck, you can choose a randomly assigned riff from one of our own professional this, comedy professionals I have a thing at a slight point deduction. We can't. Everyone's riffs are played back, and you vote for your favorite. At the end of all the rounds, the player with the most points wins. The bitch with the most points sins. Round one. Wish I had a million dollars. Hot dog. Wish I had a million dollars. Hot dog! You've seen the clip? Now enter your rift. <laughs> That's an easy one. I think number six is how to make a bomb. Number five is pretty horrific, Lead Noir. Clockwork wants to bang the, sen the Seneschal's wife. Yeah, they've seen some shit. His original catchphrase was tube steak made of meat filler. Mm, mm, <laughs> Wish I had a million dollars. Hot oh my god, or are you right? Oh boy, now I can afford that milk dad went out to buy three years. Oh my god. <laughs> Wish I had a million dollars. Hot dog. Now I'm suing these fuckers for two million for false advertising. <laughs> Wish I had a million dollars. Hot dog. Now wish for a million hot dogs. Wish mm. I had a million dollars. Hot dog! What little Jimmy didn't know was that he was getting that money via the button rules. Several families had to die for his money. <laughs> wish I had a million dollars. Hot dog! 
Now I can buy a hot dog. <coughs> Here we go again. Time to vote. Yeah, yeah there, uh, there, and there's that weird robot on the far left corner behind me, here. Who is this fucker? And who's that chubby, slimy thing on the far right that just sat down with a slurp? The big gulp. They added new characters. That's fucking cool. I'm glad they're still supporting this game. Fuck yes. I'll drink to that. Chin chin. Yes, I know chin chin means penis. Spoiler alert, I love penis. Oh, punk, no! <laughs> that was a good one. Oh no, uh, you just gotta refresh your page, Vixen. Pasow. Hard pins. You can use round molds to make many different things. You can use round molds to make many different things. Time to bring the funny. Enter your riff now. Hello, Crystarium. Yes, I'm so glad. Congrats on your PC being fixed. Oh, everyone vote for two. Everyone vote for two. Please, 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 please. This is one of the greatest scenes in Rift Tracks history. It's so funny that the audience was laughing so hard from the clip, they missed three riffs because it was a live show. But yes, everyone vote for two. And you'll see why the audience laughed so hard at the scene, they miss th three riffs. Because the audience wouldn't stop laughing. Oh yeah, it's it was uh, the live riff. Uh, the live riffs, uh, Christmas riffs with Weird Al Yankovic. You can use round molds to make many different things. Karen was the reason this product had to come with a warning label. Do not insert bat bombs into your... Uh. You can use round molds to make many different things. Like Coke bat bombs, wink. <laughs> you can use round molds to make many different things. Or just teabag the batter and try to no-scope the whole measuring shit. <laughs> you can use round molds to make many different things. I would back when you had a beard, Aura. Offering your coke in fun and interesting shapes. Everyone's doing cocaine. You can use round molds to Which, make many good different on you. things. Especially those delicious sweaty balls. You can use round molds to make many different things. <laughs> sweaty balls. After her success with cooking with Snoop Dogg, Martha Stewart decided to do a cocaine special. The FDA were called to the studio within hours. Got your favorite? Vote now! It does look like cocaine. Heroin! It looks like to me, heroin. Weird Al has that daddy energy. The accordion truly was a sex symbol. And I'm told that his biopic's actually a satire biopics. And it's actually just a really good comedy with some true stories thrown in. Oh, I'm Santa. Holy shit. Everyone sit on my lap, boobies.
Teabag it, Mary. Well, I for one am impressed. Like Coke bath bombs. Round three. I need you tonight. <laughs> Now you yeah, now you can see why they laughs the audience laughed so hard that they lost three riffs. Santa, yes, sly. Where's the furry version of Chris Hansen? Uh far away from any convention that still hosts to the ranting griffin. Three furries in the audience just lost their shit. Everyone else is like fucking like, what? But like, I swear, three furries in this audience just lost their goddamn shit. In the VOD, probably not the live one. I'm not calling to the Rendon Griffin a pedophile, I'm just saying he's a shitty person. Take your time. I am Santa. Unfortunately, Santa wasn't aware Rudolph was still a yearling and is now doing several. <laughs> I need you tonight. Again, I'm getting exhausted. When is Miss Clay's coming back home? <laughs> I need you tonight. Rudolph, with your nose so bright, want you plow my wife tonight? Santa then proceeded to do a North Pole version of a donkey show. That was talent right there. Whoever wrote that Just sin. One more time. Stick it in my ass. My God, man. I need you tonight. Santa, you've already put 24 Plan Bs into me. My tiny dear puss can't take any more Santa Daddy. My god! <laughs> sure, haven't heard that one after three Jaeger bombs before. Time to pick the funniest <laughs> riff. Vote now. Miss Cl I don't get that reference, actually. <laughs> it really is super. Yeah, come on, Jaeger bombs. My Christ, horse man. And there we have it. Yeah, what's up, Pala? Who is that, by the way? God damn. Someone want to get fuck? I fear the horse. Fuck yeah, Clockwork. You're eating ass and taking it to the bank. Please, our Lord, we all have to do things sometimes that we don't like to do. Oh, my God! Billy, to please our Lord, we all have to do things sometimes that we don't like to do. Okay. Take a deep breath and enter your breath. God. Yeah, we, we can call the trend alert here now, Aura. <laughs> oh my god, that is Jimmy Stewart from Wonderful Life. I can see why everyone's voting for that in set number three. Pure Pathos or Brunhilde? I expect terrible things from all of you fuckers.
It's your lucky gay. Jimmy Stewart's the guy who's starting wonderful life, right? I'm not just being a dumbass here, right? And by dumbass, I mean looking at my clatter and going, Hey, where's my phone? Oh. Thanks, Bridget. Punk, no! Really? To please our Lord, we all have to do things sometimes that we don't like to do. Like kissing our Dutch ovens. Okay, thank you. <laughs> to please our Lord, we all have to do things sometimes that we don't like to do. Now, stop trying to tell people about the Father's special playtimes, or God will be very angry with you. Oh no! Really? To please our Lord, we all have to do things sometimes that we don't like to do. Father Maxi liked to get on his knees for me. Luckily, he just likes to be watched like by little boys, not like those pervert in other countries. <laughs> really? <laughs> to please our Lord, we all have to do things sometimes that we Fuck don't you, Aura. I understand, I'll get naked. Billy, to please our Lord, we all have to do things sometimes that we don't like to do. Yeah, tell that to Father Matthew when he makes me swallow. Oh fuck, I wasn't supposed to tell you now I won't get candy. The rifts are in. Time to- All your terrible people? All of you are free- none of you are free from sin. All of you are filled with and replete with sin. Night thought, now's not the same time to say the word intimate. Sin is. Um, no! Sin is in, is what I was trying to say. Now, where are my peppermint schnapps? <laughs> Trend alert! Pedophilia. Anytime anything, ca anything Catholic happens. Yeah. What's a pala? Mm. Oh, come on! Go fuck yourself. <laughs> Thanks, Pussow. I'm glad I have you have my confidence. Here we go. Or whatever. You know, if it wasn't me talking, I'd say you were the prettiest girl in town. <laughs> You know, if it wasn't me talking, I'd say you were the prettiest girl in town. You've seen the clip? Now enter your rift. <laughs> Number two looks like Mel Brooks. Number one looks like something from... Never mind. Just finished with this, uh, look, the one level didn't. D what? What? Oh, oh, okay. Sorry, right. you. Sly, maybe, maybe proofread? Look at the Catholic priest could do it. I can joke about it. Yeah, let's see what these fucking peanuts are about. I yeah, hope he said peanuts. And that's a Mystery Science Theater reference for you, Phoenix, if you're still here. Legal Delta 8 was something called THCP, you know, which is called talking, God's Own Blend. Well, since you are talking, I have to say your stepsister is the hottest in town. Tell me, how did you unstick her from the washing machine again? I don't want to know. You know if it wasn't me talking, I'd say you were the prettiest girl in town. And if it was me talking, I would say you have the smallest dick in town, bitch. <laughs> you know, if it wasn't me talking, I'd say you were the prettiest girl in town. But it is me talking, so here's a bag. You know, if it wasn't me talking, I'd say you were the prettiest girl in town. George Bailey invented nagging. You know, if it wasn't me talking, I'd say you were the prettiest girl in town. Jimmy, you just had three concussions. <laughs> you know, if it wasn't me talking, I'd say you were the prettiest girl in town. But it is me talking, and I'm not going to bother with that bullshit, because I've already thoroughly clam slammed you, Cindy. <laughs> Everyone's talking about clam slamming. 
Ham Slam, which is the best. <laughs> Clamage. Barbara Streisand. Oh, wow, wow, wow! Sorry, the cats all stop to look at me and judge. <laughs> I'm just gonna remove this earring since no one can see it and it's hurting. Yeah. Here, I'm just gonna put my. My potentially problematic wig. Alright. Hello! Thank you for private parts! And oh my god, I got first play, Sue! Not to not enough to catch up with what's up or even the horse. Or super bitch. Or to change the standings at all ever, but I won first place! Round six. Sly, what Sly? Well, you good? There was a Santa Claus, and he did bring you a big brother. You know what your big brother would tell you? Mm. Well, if there was a Santa Claus, and he did bring you a big brother, you know what your big brother would tell you? Are you the next top riffer? Enter your riff. You tell yourself that all the time. <laughs> I got everything but one and six it seems to be. Uh, no, even six looks vaguely Christmas appropriate. Only one that doesn't is fucking one. Tell you Santa kidnapped him from a pagan family on the other side of the <laughs> She's globe. God. Well, if there was a Santa Claus and he did bring you a big brother, you know what your big brother would tell you? Stop ripping off peanuts before you get a sue, you stupid bitch. <laughs> well, if there was a Santa Claus and he did bring you a big brother, you know what your big brother would tell you? He'd tell you that he needs a nickel to talk to Lucy about Father Matthew's special fun time. Don't bring me into this. Well, Santa Claus, and he did bring you a big brother. You know what your big brother would tell you? You're adopted. <laughs> well, if there was a Santa Claus, and he did bring you a big brother, you know what your big brother would tell you? He would ask you if you need help getting unstuck from some sort of appliance. Then you would say no, then he would get sad and fuck a veal cuddler. Well, that seems biographical, Santa Aura. Santa Claus, and he did bring you a big brother. You know what your big brother would tell you? Bend over. <sighs> Time to place your vote, fellow rippers. God. God damn it. Put it for the wrong one. What do you mean, Aura? I think you know what I mean, Aura, Aura. Aura, Aura. A whisker. It's the same one. Oh. <laughs> I just keep it over here for safety. Just launching haunting grounds so the music was playing during Aura's alleged submission. <laughs> And see, you don't need to do pedophilia to get first place in these in these references, people. I went trauma in a whole other direction. Oh, look at that. 
Fruit Tang in first well, place. Who would have guessed? Damn, fucking evil cuntlets don't get you anywhere anymore. <laughs> Wait, what? Oh no. Yeah. They never stay on them. Yeah, that thing sucks. Yes, it does. <laughs> Jellyfish stairs. Caught on a wares. Number one looks like if Santa was a golden age superhero. Like, that's like his fucking shitty ass 30s costume would be. Oh, yeah. Like the weird fucking, just a triangle symbol in the middle. Like, oh, that's all you got? A fucking white triangle, you fucking loser. I'm not apologizing for mine either. Oh, springy is an option. Coily. Coily. Yeah, oh yeah. Oh yeah. I. Oh, you were out of the room, but like they added like four new people to oh, the shit. couch. Absolutely not. You're gonna start in a one man <laughs> donkey show again. Reindeer tonight for burning down the magic Christmas tree. Oh, Santa, can you ever forgive me? I just food myself. <laughs> Why is he now punching allegiance to the tree? Oh, Santa, can you ever forgive <coughs> That's me? The See the shit? No, not even God can forgive you <laughs> after what you did to those orphans, Billy. It's the Erd tree. This scene is I the reason Pixiv is, is getting, getting rid of Shoda. <laughs> <laughs> don't, don't talk over the jokes, but <laughs> both of you at the same time. Stash of twelve-year Glenfiddich. She poured it down the drain, and I know he used his Christmas bonus on it. <laughs> or I just lost it. Oh, Santa, can you ever forgive me? I'm sorry, I had that Harold and Maude thing with Mrs. Claus. For those of you who missed it because of uh, Aphasia making a funnier joke, the riff was this scene is why Pixiv's getting rid of Shoda. Ugh. <laughs> Aura is just taken aback with filth. You know, I stand by my joke. What, really? Really? <laughs> I was holding on to that joke because I know there are so many scenes with, scenes with children and weird situations in this fucking game. <laughs> yes, they're getting rid of- uh, only for a fan box, Aura. On the 15th, all Shoda goes that away. Time again. Enter your riff now. The policy change is mostly about violent content, but they did put that in there as well. Mm -hmm. So underage content is also uh, being uh, removed from uh, fan box. Uh, some things like, uh, violence in the context of storytelling, mm -hmm. uh, is being kept. Yeah. But, 
it's very... A lot of people are really confused because there's, like, wrestling comics that may be removed. Because there, I do know a furry artist who has a bunch of wrestling comics who are like, This punch the solar plexus makes me cum! Yeah. And, and a lot of that is just like, uh, we we'll see. <laughs> Listen, just getting punched in this one chakra is the only way I can finish. Don't take this away from me, Pixif. <laughs> Hello, Pat. Oh. We're all waiting. Oh. Jim, I feel like the signs that I am giving you are pretty clear. <laughs> I can't beat off to domestic violence reports with that snowman watching me. Time to fight it. <laughs> this is what rolling a one in real life looks like. <laughs> it's rare to see a cop react to something. <laughs> Stop resembling Andy Richter. No. But I love pulling the patch while I'm driving. The rifts are in. Time to vote. God damn it. <laughs> Who did it? <laughs> Having this foreskin disease is the only way I can come. Meat Log Mountain be like. I'm going to sexualize this foreskin disease. Phimosis is so hot, we're just gonna keep applying J Lube until you fucking come and get it off. That's not how it works! Uh. I do wanna give this riff bottom a vote. Yeah, number four takes that one fucking away. It wasn't mine. Yeah, that was super. Oh my fuck! Yeah, micro. That's the maximum points I think you can get for this. My fucking god! <laughs> Jesus, what? Oh, thanks, what's Paula? I thought long and hard about mine, but no. I got white people. If I go to see Santa Claus, I'm real polite. I bet. He can get my mama and papa back. If I go to see Santa Claus, if I'm real polite, I bet he can get my mama and papa back. Oh no! <laughs> okay. Take a deep breath and enter. Everyone do your goddamn absolute fuck to be worst and vote number four. Or six, or six. Vote four or six. Six is also really fucking acceptable. Weights and heavy anticipation. Negotiates with terrorists. <laughs> if that's true, then Santa Claus allowed slavery in the Holocaust to happen, and I don't want to unpack that. Well, it's too late. If I'm real polite, I bet you can get my mama and papa back. Good luck. I asked the mall Santa the same thing, but he only offered to be my new daddy. Santa Claus, if I'm real polite, I bet you can get my mama and papa back. Uh, Timmy, they're in jail for selling secrets to Russia. <laughs> I want to see Violent Night so bad. Me too. You can get my mama and papa back. Your parents are dead, Elijah. Where do you think you were right It looks like literally the movie from Scrooge. The night the reindeer died. Yeah. I bet you can get my mama and papa back. Oh, oh, honey, no. They're dead. Just like your dreams and God. I go to see Santa Claus. I'm real polite. I bet. He can get my mama and papa back. 
But can he keep you instead? <laughs> I'm real polite, I bet. He can get my mama and papa back. Becky, Mama and Papa aren't getting back together because Papa caught Mama fucking the pool boy after he finished inside of the pool boy. Jesus God! <laughs> Santa needs money and sells his toy production stuff, including the elves to the US military. Oh, uh. I can't. I don't know that one. I've never heard of this one. But I want to see it. Real fucking bad. It almost feels like that uh, bad uh, Santa Claus game that they played on Game Grumps where they had to... Mm -hmm. <laughs> you know... Oh, I There's a Home Alone Zero. There's a movie that predates Home Alone by a year that came out in France. I remember now. Dial Code Noel. We watched It's that. hardcore rated R. Yeah, so the French did Home Alone a year before Home Alone, and it's rated R, and it's delightful. Bitch, I knew Nietzsche wouldn't one, drop me. Oh, he would, because the comics will only work that much. But if you do really good in the next round, you can still fail by a thousand. Fuck. <laughs> yeah. It's, it's called time. Fat Man. Yes! Pray for sinners. No. I like how we're ending on a long Christmas one. I can make it Christmas. Pray for sinners. No. It's go time, Mama Jama. Into your rips. I'm not winning this one. It's your lucky gay. Look at that little slinky fucker. Right? <laughs> one associate's exactly like me. I know. Eyes open, not blinking. <laughs> <laughs> Assumed dead. <laughs> Pray for sinners. For the Christmas no. spirit, you know? He's dealing with some Catholic guilt right now. He just shot a hot, nasty wad after jerking it to some nasty clown porn. There it is. Pray for sinners. No. And help me find the strength to hang my paper towels in the proper over the rollway. The scene, this movie is available on Shudder, by the way. No. Yes. Joe Bob Briggs is a great episode Dear of it. Oh God, it's true, it's all true. The laughter, the tears, the screams. The really did all float down there, and now we will too. Pray for sinners. I like that one. No. Now time for code. <laughs> Pray for sinners. No. Oh, his solemn prayer before packing into a car with 30 of his friends. Pray for sinners. No. Oh, and let that little shit heel Timmy lose his eye to his Red Rider BB gun. Amen. Time to pick the funniest trip. <laughs> Vote now. All right. Let's have a December of uh, the, the Christmas movie sequels that we didn't do. Oh. You know there's enough of them. Mm, there's too many. <sighs> Home Alone 666. Crossover with, with Arnold Schwarzenegger's in the days. <laughs> Home Alone in the Dark. I paid money for that one. Yeah. 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 Time for Coke. <laughs> <laughs> 
Harper's Island. Yes, I have watched Harper's Island. I fucking is. love Harper's Island. What's Harper's Island? Ah, uh, la 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 la. Get ready. No. <laughs> it's six hours long. What? <laughs> Where can we watch Harper's Island? Or, uh... Question mark. The end? Yep. Mm. Uh -huh. Give me a second. No. One <laughs> second. There you go, little bitch. Wiener. Defrosted caveman. <laughs> Moose baby. That's my new. That's my new uh, safe word. Suburban Sam Squanch. And the cool Barbara. Grocery witch. Hey, hey. Punk Piglet. That's a. That's a one to be envied of. 